guys, this is Morkborg here with part two of my January 2020 phone collection. So let's continue from where we left off in the previous part. So this is my iPod Touch fourth generation. This one works, but it is dead. This is my HTC Desire 510. I have two of these. This one works. This is my other iPhone 4S. This one works. But it is dead. This is my iPhone 4. This one works. But it is also dead. This is my HTC Evo Shift 4G. Um, this one does not have a battery in it. Oops. Um, this is my ZTE Blade Vantage. This one works. This is my other HTC Desire 510. This one works. This is my LG Rizio. This one works. This is my last Ematic E8 MP3 player. The, this one works as well, but it is dead. This is my HTC Evo 4G. This one works. This is my LG Optimus V. This one works. And then this is my other iPod Touch first generation. It's dead, but it works. Um, now we're moving on to dumb phones. As you can see, I have many of them here. This is my Sony Ericsson TM506. This one works. This is my Nokia 2285. It does not have a battery in it. This is one of my two Palm Centros. This one does work. But it is dead. This is my Nokia N75. This one works, but it is dead. Yeah, this one I haven't been able to charge in about three years. Which kind of sucks, because I like this phone. It's probably one of my nicest flip phones. This is my Samsung SCH A670. This one is also dead, and it hasn't had a... a charge in about two years. This is my Samsung SGH S125G. This one works, but it doesn't have a battery in it. This is my Nokia Neuron. Someone in the comments of a video of mine told me what this was, like the name of it, and I, I thank them for that. I forgot their username. Yeah, but if I remembered it, I would definitely give them a shout out. Yeah, but... Yeah, it's the Nokia Neuron. This is my LG 840G. This one does not have a battery in it. But if I remember correctly, I believe it works. This is my Motorola V265. This one is untested. This is my Kyocera Domino. This one's also untested. This is my some sort of Kyocera phone. I don't remember what this is. It's untested. This is uh, a Blackberry Curve. Uh, I think uh, 93 something. 93... 93.50 I think it is. Let me check. No, it's a 93.70. That was close. This is a, a pretty nice Blackberry. This is my Palm Pre. This one works, but I can't set it up. And then I'm going to come around again. This is one of my two Samsung bright sides. This one is dead. This is my Samsung Freeform 3. It does not have a battery in it. This is my Moto Motorola Razr. One of my two of them. This one 
works, but it's dead. This is my LG Chocolate. This one, um, this one is untested. This is my Samsung SGH T105G. This one works, but doesn't have a battery in it. This is, uh, I forget. Yeah, I won't be able to show you though, because it's dead. This is my Samsung Gusto 3. This one works, but it doesn't have a battery in it. This is my Sanyo SCP-7000. Works, but it is dead. This is my one of my Samsung Gusto 2s. This one works, but it does not have a battery in it. This is one of my two Samsung SCH-R451Cs. This one, um, this one works, but it doesn't have a battery in it. This is my BlackBerry World Edition 8830. This one is untested. This is one of my two LG Cosmos, but this one does not have a battery in it. This is my Samsung SCH A850. This one is untested. This is my LG MV3. One of them. Uh, this one does not have a battery in it either. This is my LG Banter. This one um, doesn't work. This is my Nokia 8270. This one also does not work. This is one of my two Doro Phone Easy 626s. Uh, this one does not work. This is my Samsung Trance. This works, but it's it hasn't had a charge in about two years as well. Well, actually closer to about three at this point. Um, this is my other Doro Phone Easy 626. This one also does not work. Yeah, if I remember correctly, I believe these two were the last uh, most recently acquired dumb phones in my collection. Yeah, and that was back in July. Um, so this is one of my two Samsung SCH U410s. This one works, but it's dead. This is my Sanyo Katana. This one is untested. This is a, another one of those LG phones. I think this is... Uh, I don't know what it is. I can't show you either because it's dead. This is my Samsung character. This is, works, but it's dead. This is my ZTE MF61 mobile hotspot. It's untested. This is my Blackberry style uh, 9670. I'm gonna come around again. Y'all yeah, be doing that a lot in these videos. Um, okay, this is uh, some generic phone. I don't know right off what it is. This is my Samsung Snap. This one works, but it is dead. This is my Motorola i875 with a button to open the phone. So you can see I'm going to press it. Pretty cool, you don't need your to use your whole hand to open it. This is my Sony Ericsson S312. This one is untested. This is my other Blackberry Curve. This is a, I think it's a 85 something. 8530 maybe. Yeah, this is the 8530. I'm surprised I remember that. This is my LG Reverse 3. This one, it works. This is my Doro Phone Easy 410. This one is untested. This is my Nokia 5170i. This one works, but it is dead. This is my AudioVox CDM9000. This one is This one is untested. This is my LG Cosmos 3. This one is locked. 
but it does work. Uh, this is my LG VM101. It does not work. Uh, this is my Motorola i776. I was able to test it because it has a micro USB port, but I found out that it is it has a bad screen. This is my Samsung SGH T139. This one is water damaged. This is my iPod Nano first generation. This one works, but only on the charger. This is my BlackBerry Tor 90, uh, 9630. This one does not work. This is my Motorola i730. This one is untested. This is my uh, T-Mobile Spark 2. This one. Uh, this one does. This one's untested. That's right. This is my. Another Samsung Gusto 2. This one uh, has some damage. Like I know right here, it has some screen damage. This is my LG UX830. This one is untested. This is my LG441G. This one, um, this one does not recognize any of my SIM cards. This is my Motorola WX416. This one does work. This is my Samsung Flight. This one works. Uh, yeah, it's not dead. This is my uh, Fast Tracks MP4 player. Um, I did a video about this, so go check that out. Uh, it only works on the charger, sadly. This is my other LG MP3. I know this one works. I'm going to come around again. Uh, this is my Motorola Razer, another one. This one is dead. This is my LG UX uh, 210 that works. And then this is my LG Exalt. This one also works. This is my Alcatel Big Easy Flip. It is untested. This is my other Samsung SCHU410. This one is dead, but it works. This is my Motorola StarTac. This one is untested. This is my Ptel Ice. This one is untested. This is my Samsung Convoy 3. It works, but it is dead. This is uh, another Dorophone EZ618. This is my Kyocera Wildcard. This one is untested. This is my LG VX8300. This one is locked. This is my Samsung Sway. This one is untested. This is my Samsung Reclaim. It works, but doesn't have a battery in it. This is my uh, Samsung Slash. This one works. This one works, but it doesn't have a battery in it. This is my BlackBerry Pearl 8100. This one is untested. This is my LG PM225. Uh, it works, but it doesn't have a battery in it. And then this is uh, another Dorophone EZ618. This one works, but it is dead. And then this is my LG 1010. This one's also untested. So that is uh, part two of my January 2020 phone collection video. Hope you enjoyed. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in part three. Peace.